hello I'm in my uh, greenhouse and I've got a little idea for you um, you might be doing this already and if you are brilliant but it's about a month ago and I thought I fancied some salad to tell the truth and I'm not growing any on on the allotment um, in fact I am growing I've got some salad leaves out there but they're being destroyed systematically destroyed by bugs whether it be slugs or i don't know just then um i've not netted it and it's just all going to seed and it's awful so that didn't that really didn't work so i thought it'd be nice just to take some salad home you know um for tonight you know but i didn't have anything so i thought okay what i'll do is I will plant or sow uh, salad seeds every day. That's what I'll do. I'll get a small container, sow the seeds, and take the container home. If, if I want some salad, I'll just get one off the shelf, take it on. So this is the result. Um, it's a six pack container and this is baby lettuce and uh, as you can see the <laughs> the label is <laughs> uh, no longer functioning but I usually put the the name of the stuff and when it was sown on the label it's rubbed off so there we are but that's about 20 it's about 21 days growth there so i planted that three weeks ago i sowed the seed three weeks ago and there we are so if i want any salad tonight i can just take that on with me um i live just down the road so it's easy to carry I can put it on the table you can cut a bit off as cut as much as you want off there's only two of us so it's a reasonable amount of salad and you know i'm quite pleased with myself because i have been planting most days i've been sowing uh seeds so not every day you know you, you sometimes you forget sometimes you can't be bothered anyway These are the seeds that I'm using. And it's from a company called Just Seed. And it's 25, I think 25 grams of baby lettuce. Um, lettuce mixed baby leaf salad. So um, there's loads of seed in there. And I bought this last year, but I was going to plant it outside. And I never really... It never really worked. It was just, it was an idea and it, it just didn't, it didn't, you, you, there was always something eating the salad, you know, before you got to it. And uh, it, I just got fed up with it. So what I do here is I take, let's have a look here. Take a six pack, yeah, like this. And fill it with um, good quality compost. I use clover. I like clover. It would never have any problems with that at all. Um, so I fill my six pack with good quality compost. Sprinkle the seeds on. The seeds are very well they're not they're not tiny um but give you an idea so you just give you an idea here of what we're dealing with so there's the seed mixed seed and um you just sprinkle that 
onto the surface of the compost and put some more compost over it just cover it lightly and then water it and then I water it again so it's um, because the compost soaks quite a lot of water up so I water it again then you label it put the date on and then just put it onto a shelf in the greenhouse now when it germinates which is what is happening here I think these have been up for about two days I put this in on the 26th of July and it's the third it's the 30th today when when the seeds are germinating um, it's the height of summer at the moment so if you leave these in the greenhouse now they're going to bolt they're going to go to seed because it's too warm so all i do is i just i've got a shelf out the back outside at the back of the allotment it doesn't get a lot of sun it's quite cool out there and i just put this i'll put them I'll, when it gets to this stage i'll just pop that on on the shelf outside scatter a few slug pallets around um, and then just leave it so I've got I've got them all a different you know each day if you do that you get a steady it's like a conveyor belt of salad you know and um, it's handy you know it's um, if you've got new potatoes coming out I've got potatoes there and I'm just uh, harvesting them you can have a, you can make a potato salad can't you, you know um, it, I have eggs I've got chicken so I get eggs so you can make your own mayonnaise salad uh, boiled eggs boiled egg um, egg mayonnaise and yeah you know so it's it gives you something to it gives you a sense of achievement that you're growing something to eat you know and it's very easy and it's very simple uh, and that's it really so you know hopefully you will um, if you're not already doing this you know if you're not already doing this give it a go because you know you start today plant your uh, sow your seeds every day and eventually you'll get a really good supply of um, baby leaf salad and I'm not saying it's going to save you a fortune you know but it's it's just it, you know it's organic it's organic it's um, fresh it's nutritious brilliant um, I've also um, decided that um, I'm going to do the same thing with spinach um, so you can you can you can if you, if, you, if you sow your spinach every day put it out somewhere cool um i presume in winter you could bring everything into the greenhouse and, and um, you, you'll get a nice winter supply of, of greens but i think like uh, this baby lettuce spinach and i'm going to have a go at um kale the um I think it's called Negro. Um, I think that it's like got it's it's a bit like uh, Savoy cabbage to eat. I'm going to have a do at that as well, but I'm going to put that in bigger pots. Um, but you, you can plant if you you can sow things every day, you know. So then you're getting this supply, this conveyor belt, and. It's surprising how you know like a month ago I had nothing and now I've got an abundance of salad and, and I'm, I'm really pleased that I did that and um, hopefully you'll do the same or you're doing the same and it's great.
So there's a little tip for you. Uh, see you again soon.